What's going on guys, I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media bringing you some official details regarding the upcoming 250 million download celebration for both Global Dokkan and JP Dokkan. As we'll see in a second, all the information in this video will be courtesy of two French data miners on Twitter, Kawai and I seriously, so a huge shout out to those guys for leaking the V jump info and making this video possible. By the way, if I look tired in this video, because I freaking am. I stayed up pretty much all night checking Twitter every 30 minutes to an hour to see if the V-Jump leaks had dropped. And as you can see, the first tweet came out at 5.37 a.m. and I pretty much haven't slept a wink since then. Just constantly refreshing the feed to see if more information has come out. And at this point, I think all the info from V-Jump regarding the celebration has been released. So let's talk about it. Unfortunately, I'm not the most well-versed in the French language. I want to take this opportunity to apologize to all my French teachers between grades 4 to 12, so we will have to use the translate tweet feature. Here we go. So at 5.37 a.m., Kawhi tweeted out, V-Jump confirms that we will receive tickets for 250 million according to Dragonstone spent between July 22nd, 2017 and August 21st, 2018. So that's really cool. I think a lot of people were expecting us to get tickets for the celebration, but to have it confirmed officially in V-Jump is very, very exciting. And for those of you who have no idea what's going on here, basically in that time period for every 50 stones that we spent, we will get one summoning ticket for a special Dokkan Fest banner specifically for the celebration. Last time around, there were uh, top tier units at the time like AGL Rosé and Physical Vegito Blue. And this time, I hope that they will replace those guys with Strength Rosé and Tech Vegito Blue as well as some other top tier units like 120 leads and Category leads. I don't know if I'm asking for too much, but at the very least, I hope that there's Strength Rosé because I really, really need that guy for a lot of my teams. But you know what? That's besides the point. We're getting summoning tickets. Freaking awesome. Moving right along. I think the next tweet was from I Seriously, and I, I believe he was talking about the same thing actually. Let's see, uh, 250 million downloads officially confirmed by V-Jump. Okay, scans coming soon. And also we're gonna get tickets for that time period. Okay, same thing, cool. Thank you, I Seriously and Kawhi. Moving on here. Okay, so this tweet over here is Kawhi talking about the fact that there will be another global versus JP campaign for the celebration. And uh, they're gonna consider a lot of different factors to determine who wins this one. So there's gonna be number of Zennies, number of Zennies, number of Zenny collected, um, number of Dokening Awakenings, Dokken Awakenings done, um, number of levels completed for a certain event. And at this point, I believe it is a brand new Piccolo event that we can farm for a free to play Piccolo. But I'm not 100% sure if that's the one they're referring to. And uh, also, the winner will receive a Super Saiyan Goku, while the loser will receive a Frieza. And uh, you know what? There's not that much information regarding what the cards actually do or what they look like, but you can pretty much be sure that neither of them will be that top tier. You're not gonna be running the Super Saiyan Goku if you win it on a optimal like SDR team or whatever type he is. And obviously the Frieza, since it's the loser reward, it's gonna be even worse than that. These guys are both gonna be kind of you know commemorative or like kind of like souvenirs so of the celebration. Um, so they're just cool things to have. And to be honest, uh, even though the Frieza's for the loser, I kind of kind of want him over the Goku because we have a lot of Super Saiyan Gokus in the game. But to have like a funny losing Frieza in whatever form it's in. Uh, would be really cool. So <laughs> to be honest, I wouldn't mind losing that. But you know, let me know in the comments below what you guys uh, think about that. Whether you're excited for the Goku or the Frieza, and which one you want more. I personally, like I said, want the Frieza more. So hey, if you guys want to lose for Global, that's cool with me. Moving right along. Um, okay, so this one is just Kawhi, I think, talking about. Yeah, he's he just telling us, letting us know that he's farming the, the Turkey statues for the EZA Broly event. Cool, good to know. New Piccolo will be given as a connection bonus, is the Piccolo I was referring to before. And uh, when he says connection bonus, it sounds like he's saying, well at least translation says connection bonus, it sounds like it's saying that it's going to be a login bonus, but I'm not sure if it's going to be actually a login bonus or an event where you can farm the Piccolo, because to me it sounds like it's taking the place of the tech uh, free to play Bulma that came out last time, and essentially you'll be able to farm dupes of the Piccolo, and also uh, farm his orbs as well for a free rainbow in that specific event. But you know, there's not that much information regarding that yet, so I'm not really sure. So it could be a login bonus. The news stipulates that it will be able to TUR and transform itself by fulfilling the conditions. So it is the first free to play unit, uh, as far as I'm aware. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the first free to play unit that has a transformation, which would be really, really awesome. And obviously, I love Piccolo, so 
you know, there's nothing wrong with that. And Kawhi follows up on the tweet by saying that the Piccolo AGL, so it's going to be an AGL Piccolo, will be offered as a connection bonus. Again, with a connection bonus, so maybe it is going to be a login bonus. And it will be able to transform, assimilate with Nail if the conditions are met. So we don't know what the conditions are, but what it sounds like is that it's going to be a base form Piccolo. And then once certain conditions are met, maybe past like three turns or maybe at under 50% health or 80% health, then he has a chance to transform into Piccolo fused with Nail and get more powerful. So, hey, I'll take that. That's That sounds pretty sweet. Moving on here. Um, hmm. Uh, I don't think this is any revela relevant things. Uh, Kawhi is saying here that, yeah, so when <laughs> the 150 million celebration came out, um, they people were having really, like, a lot of trouble getting their tickets. Apparently, Bandai was just having issues for some reason getting people their tickets, or maybe they were having issues with the calculations. But some people had to literally email Bandai and fight for their tickets to get them. So let's hope that they don't mess things up this time. Everyone just gets their tickets on day one and everyone's happy. But, um, you know, I don't know. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Here we go. Remember, oh, so this one is important. Basically, he's saying that all Dragonstones that are used between the periods, uh, I, I believe it was July 21st, 2017, and uh, August 22nd, 2018, all Dragonstones used in that period will count, whether it's for summoning, um, refreshing the Baba Shop, um, refreshing stamina, using continues for stages, or anything like that. All of them will count towards your total stone count, and it's, again, it's 50 for one summoning ticket. So... You know, it's relevant information because some people might just think it's only for summoning or whatever, but all the stones you spent, no matter what's what it's for, will count towards that total. And uh, just one more thing, I believe. So, I seriously here told us that Boss Rush Stage 6 is coming. It will give you 35 Dragon Stones, and it's planned for the 250 million download celebration as well. So, that's exciting. More Boss Rush means more stones. If I were to just you know venture a quick guess, I would say it's probably five more category bosses. And if you guys were able to clear stage five with no issues, then stage six, stage six, stage six shouldn't present many issues for you either. So that's another 35 more free stones for us. And another detail to add on to that is from Kawhi up here somewhere. He was saying that, um, here we go. He was saying something about, oh, Plus, there seems to be an extra reward if you succeed boss rush according to a time limit. So I don't know if that's going to be specifically for stage six, or is it? It's going to be for all the stages before. They're just going to add that add, as those add those as missions for all the previous stages too. So if you reclear them within a certain time limit, you will get more stones. I don't know. It could be just for stage six, but either way, that means more stones as well on top of the 35 stones. So yo, I'll take it. I'll take it. There's nothing wrong with more free stones. I'm gonna refresh real quick to see if there's anything else. No, it looks like that's it. And the reason I made this video was because they were quiet for a while. And now it looks like, I mean, at least all the information they have for the time being is present on Twitter. And that's everything we've talked about so far. Um, a few other things, of course, that I wanted to cover are there are rumors that there's gonna be an LR Frieza and Goku, and also a LR Great Saiyan Man 1 and 2 for the friend summons. At the time, you know, for the time being, there's nothing in V-Jump that seems to indicate that's coming. And I'm not saying that it won't happen. You know, obviously that information came from somewhere, from like data mining or something. But until there's some concrete evidence of that, I'm going to hold off on confirming it. I'm just going to say that it's likely, it's really exciting if it does, and I hope it happens. But don't be too surprised if it doesn't. I'm going to leave it at that. And also some more exciting news specifically for global players. It sounds like... They are testing the new summoning animations for Global, and they appear to be scheduled to come out for the 250 download, 250 million download celebration. Um, so that's really exciting for a Global player. Really, really cool. Can't wait for Vegito, Vegito Blue, for you know, double screen crack with Oolong and Hercule riding on Boo and all those cool things. So yo, if you're a Global player, get hyped for that. That's another extra thing that we're getting. But aside from that, this is all the information I have right now. It's all the information that we can get from B-Jump. If there's anything else that comes out, you can be sure that your boy Tiger will keep you up to date. So if you guys are new to the channel and you want more updates like this, then maybe consider hitting that big red subscribe button and I'll make sure that I have you covered whenever new information about the 250 million download celebration comes out. But anyways, guys, that's the whole video for today. Um, I'm pretty sure I covered everything for the time being. 
And uh, that's it. If you guys like the video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, like I said, maybe consider hitting that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And I'll make sure that you guys are always kept up to date with relevant information regarding this game and possibly some other games in the future as well. But for now, hope you guys have a fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.